Hey guys, welcome back to Explodey FPS. Today, we're finally fixing that weirdly frustrating thing where Rain Meter Spotify skins just don't sync up properly. They look cool, yeah, but they either lag, show nothing, or act like Spotify doesn't even exist. <laughs> so let's fix it and do it in style. All right, here's what's going on. Most Spotify skins in Rainmeter either use outdated plugins or depend on newer ones that don't quite match up. Result, the skin just doesn't work. No song info, no album art, not even basic play pause controls. Wow, thanks skin. But don't worry, we'll fix this using a tool called Spectify, tweak one config file, and by the end of this, your skin will not only sync perfectly, it'll control your Spotify like a boss. <laughs> okay, step one, super basic. Head to the first link in the description. Yeah, I know, boring. But this step, it's the magic sauce. You'll see a command there. Copy that bad boy. Now, hit your Windows key, type PowerShell, right-click it, and select Run as administrator. Always run as admin. Always. No mercy. Paste the command in, press enter. It'll ask you something like, do you want to abort the installation process? Uh, no. We're literally trying to install it. So just hit N, then enter. Then it'll ask, do you also want to install Spectify Marketplace? For me? Hmm, and again, enter, then type exit. Boom, easy, right? We're halfway done. Now on to step two. This is where the plugin magic comes in. Hit the second link in the description. You'll land on a page with a huge red circle, arrow, and text that's practically yelling at you. Download this image right now, click it here now. <laughs> yeah, that one, click it. I've already got it downloaded, but for you, just double click and install once it's done. You'll see two components during install, webnowplaying.dll, webnowplaying redux. Redux usually works better, but you can install both. Switch them later if needed. All set? Told you it wasn't hard. Now, final step. Let's edit the Raymuter skin itself. Right click your Spotify skin and hit edit skin. Inside the config file, you'll see stuff like measure title, measure artist, cover, position, progress, and a few others. Some lines will have stuff like plugin equals now playing dot DLL or player name equals some random thing. Here's all you need to do. Wherever it says now playing dot DLL, now play dot DLL or anything similar, Replace it with web now playing. And if there's a player name line, set that to Spotify. That's it. You're literally telling the skin, hey buddy, stop being confused and just use the proper plugin. And yes, it's Spotify. Now save that config file. Right click the skin again and hit refresh. Boom. Your skin's alive. You'll now see the track name, artist, album art, and even have controls like play, pause, skip, preview, depending on your skin's features. And that's it. Just a few tweaks and you've got a fully working, synced Spotify rain meter setup. No more broken skins, no more guessing if it's working. If this helped, smash that like button and maybe hit subscribe too. Catch you in the next one. Until then, keep your setup clean and your vibes synced. 